Good morning, preschoolers. Happy Monday. Can you believe it? It's Monday already. Boy, that weekend went fast, didn't it? I spent the weekend out working in my yard. I even got a little bit of a sunburn on my nose. I don't know if you guys can tell from over there, but it was a really nice weekend with so much sunshine and we had a hot dog on the grill. It felt like a little bit of summer. Didn't that feel nice? I hope you all got to enjoy that as well. Well, today, um, for the next couple of days, I want to read to you some books that I really love. These are the Todd Parr books. And Todd, Bar Todd Parr, excuse me, writes books that are all about how cool it is to be exactly who you are. Um, you can be all sorts of different kinds of things. And we're going to read about that in this book. Let's look at the back cover, too. One of the things that I love about Todd Parr's artwork is, first of all, they're always kind of crazy characters. They can be, you know, all different colors and they have like this family is a space family, an alien family. You know, this guy has purple skin. It's always, you know, she's got like crazy, crazy, big, curly, beautiful hair. You know, um, this guy's got his hair sticking up all over the place in spikes. And, and isn't that the way that we really are? All so different and, and all so beautiful. The other thing that I love about Todd Parr's artwork is you guys can draw these pictures. These are very simple drawings that you can recreate. So it's really fun because you can read these and you can recreate them. So <clears throat> look at this pink hair. I love curly hair. I don't know if you guys know this, but if Mrs. Y could have any kind of hair, it would be giant puffy curly hair. I love curly hair. All right, Be Who You Are by Todd Parr. Be Who You Are. Be old. Be young. Be a different color. Wear everything you need to be you. Speak your language. He says, hola. And she's speaking the language of love. And this dog said, meow. And this dog said, hello. <laughs> Learn in your own way. So this cat is like, hmm, I wonder what dog food is. So he touches it. And he's like questioning it. Some people learn best by touching. Be proud of where you are from. Be your own family. Just be who you are. Be silly. Be brave. Dance. Play. Discover, learn, read. I love all these different pictures. Share your feelings. Happy, mad, sad, silly, scared, proud. Just be who you are. Try new things. Oh, look, these, these pigeons. This reminds me of the book Mrs. C reads when the pigeon finds a hot dog. They're like, hmm, this is a taco. But they're like, hmm, should I try this? I don't know. Look at these guys are like, yes, we love tacos. And there's pizza and noodles. Oh my gosh. So many fun things to try. Be confident. Stand up for yourself. Look, the mouse says, no. Be energetic. Be peaceful. Be the best that you can be. Just be who you are. 
It doesn't matter what color you are, where you are from, or who is in your family. Everyone needs to be loved. Always love yourself and be who you are. The end. Love, Todd. So that's the message of this book. Be who you are. Don't worry about what other people think. Do the things that make you feel happy. Do the things that feel right for you. Okay? So today for your activity, I thought it might be fun to um, get a piece of paper and write your name in the middle, nice and big. I wrote Mrs. Y. You write your name. And then I looked through a magazine and some sticker books and I found all the things that I think, well, not all the things, there's a lot more things here that I could add, but many of the things that are who I am. I'm a person who loves to have barbecue parties with my family. I love to go to the beach. I love, oh, that's the word family. I love my family. I love my dog. I love sports, especially to watch my kids play sports. I love pizza. I love trying new recipes. I love to cook. That's part of who I am. I love to try new things. I love tigers. They're my favorite wild animal. Oh, I love the color purple. And over here I put a flower and some butterflies because gardening makes me happy. Growing things, growing flowers. Um, I put the word smart because that's part of who I am. I am a smart person. So you go through and find the things that tell about you. Who are you? When, when I say be who you are, what does that make you think of? Who do you want to be? Are you powerful? Are you brave? Are you um, a reader? Are you a person who loves to take care of other people like or animals? Who are you? Add all the things to your collage and then when you're done with your collage, you can take a picture of it and add it to Seesaw. Okay, so I'll see you guys and I hope to see your collages and I hope to see who you are. All right. Bye, guys.